Hey YouTube family, it's your girl Cindy. Welcome back to my channel. On this channel, I break down relationship dynamics in real life and on TV. Check out my playlist in the description after this video. If you are new to my channel, welcome and thank you for joining me today. In this video, I will be sharing five tips to cope with life transitions. So be sure to like this video, subscribe and click that notification bell. Life is full of changes and many of them are hard to deal with. It can be challenging to cope with the stress of life transitions. A life transition is any change or adjustment that impacts your life in a significant way. We all experience transitions throughout our lives, whether big or small, planned or unplanned. Transitions can be something exciting, such as starting a new job, adding to your family, but they can also be upsetting situations such as um, the loss of a loved one, divorce, or even the onset of this pandemic that we've been living in. Many people struggle with change, especially when turning a certain age, approaching a retirement, or becoming a parent. The process of getting adjusted to a new routine can feel very overwhelming. Let's jump into five tips on how to manage life transitions. Create a plan. If possible, try to plan for your transition by outlining a plan for the logistics of your transition by defining your goals on paper. Creating an effective action plan starts with defining and mapping out the steps for what you would like the end result to be. Divide the goals into milestones and identify the resources you'll need to achieve your goals. It's important to prioritize certain tasks, but it is also a good idea to review, reflect, and refine your plan as you navigate through the transition. Stay connected. Social support is crucial during times of transition. Identifying and expressing your feelings is important. Chatting with family, friends, colleagues, or even a professional can be a way to help your transition feel less stressful and lonely. Give yourself some grace. Change is difficult and trying to navigate a life transition perfectly is unrealistic. It is important to be kind and compassionate towards yourself during times of change. It's okay to feel overwhelmed or stressed when navigating a change in life. But remember, you have all that you need and what it takes to get through the storm. Try to have a positive outlook. Focus on the positive aspects. Shifting your mindset about the transition can help you manage your stress and possible anxiety towards the change. When you look out for the hopeful signs in every transition, it will actually help you to feel better. Try to accept and understand that change is essential to life. Without change, our life courses can be pretty boring and dull. You may not seek change, but when it seeks you, try to take it in stride and understand that no one's life ever stands completely still. People enter your world and leave it, material possessions come and go, and careers often in involve turning points. No one gets through life without experiencing some type of change. So when it happens, try not to fight it and view it as an opportunity to grow. Now, how do you cope with life transitions? Let's continue this conversation in the comments. I will actually be transitioning from producing weekly YouTube videos to podcasting on a bi-weekly basis. My episodes will be uploaded to my YouTube channel, so please follow my journey and continue to support my channel by watching, liking, and sharing my content. I will continue to discuss relationship dynamics and pretty much talk about all things relationships. My podcast is called Stand In Your Truth, which can currently be found on Anchor, Spotify, and Buzzsprout. I will be sharing tips and answering questions from my listeners. I am excited for this transition and I look forward to connecting with my tribe. Friendly reminder, I am a co-parenting coach and I do offer a free strategy session. Click the link in the description for additional information. If you have any questions for me or suggestions for me for my upcoming podcast episodes, 
please put them in the comments. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and also share this video with someone that you know that can benefit from this content. I hope this video was helpful and I look forward to going on my podcast journey with you starting on March 22nd. So until then, bye for now.